So let's draw a line between your product and the customer that is helping. You see, if your customer doesn't understand how your product or service helps them, they're not going to buy it. We're gonna get this done in a few simple steps. Let's connect your product or service to your customer. Step one, let's talk about the features. I know we've talked about this before. Features are those things that are tied to what your product does. If you're a bicycle company, you're going to talk about the suspension, the handlebars. Those are all things that are features of your bicycle. Then after that, you're going to try to figure out what those benefits are. Why is having a better suspension important? Third, we're gonna talk about what value that brings to your customer. So if you're the bicycle company with the top-notch suspension, of course, then your benefit's going to be that it's a smoother ride. Well, what value does that bring to your customer? Well, if they have a smoother ride, then they're probably going to ride longer because they're not going to get as tired. Now we're gonna take those features, benefits, and value and tie back to the problem that you're solving for your customer. By doing this, you are going to be able to directly answer the questions to their problems or even to their buying decisions of why they're gonna choose you or choose somebody else. This is gonna shorten your lead time, it's gonna make it easier to close the sale, and you're gonna have a better connection with that customer. This quick little exercise you can get done in less than an hour. So go ahead, what are you waiting for? Take the time to figure out your features, your benefits, your values, and tie that back to the customer.